Hi there, this is Sanjay and I welcome you all to this English learning YouTube channel English Every Day. In today's video, again, we are going to talk about Indian accent. Yes, because uh, still there is a problem like uh, people in Taiwan, they are unable to understand Indian accent. And this is how we need to practice more and more. So this video again would be a practice video for you. Recently, I had uploaded a video also that was about Diwali festival, which is one of the greatest festival in India. And today uh, I will be talking about the general things. So uh, the topic I can have for you maybe. Okay, let's talk about how to achieve goal into our life. So I will be discussing about several points and that will be really very useful. On the other way, this video would be an exercise for you to be more familiar with Indian accent. So let me start with some points and I'm switching myself to Indian accent now. So how to get happiness into our life? To get happiness, we need to have certain things into our life and we need to practice them regularly into our way we are living our life. So I have uh, planned several points and these points will be really very helpful and uh, you can be on a track and you can be very happy into your life. So the first point I would like to address is self-assessment. You should know what you are. Many people they don't know what are their good habits, what are their bad habits and they don't know even what are the things they do to make them happy, what are the things that can make them feel very angry. So the first thing is you need to know yourself and once you know what you are then it will be really very easy for you to attract a goal into your life. So once you have one goal into your life, you can start working on it because many people, they don't have a goal in their life. And, you know, there is necessary. It is necessary for you that you must have a goal because once you have a goal into your life, you can start working on it. You give your time on it. And once you give time on it, you feel that, yes, your time is being invested somewhere where it can be utilized. Now, the second point is you should have a goal after you self assess yourself i mean you do uh, you know more information about you second point is you need to have a certain goal a clear goal you should say yourself that what you exactly want in your life for example if you want to be uh, an engineer you want to be a phar pharmacologist or anybody you want to i mean any goal you have to save in your life and that should be a clear goal you should not be distracted like somewhere or the other you feel oh i need to do this one and on um, as the time being you feel oh i need to change this goal and you need to go on another one so you should have one goal and that should be the personal private or you can say the clear goal of your life so once you have set your goal in your life the second step you have to do is to do the practices you know the more you practice the better you become you know that so once you decide what is your goal you have to start practicing about that goal practicing here means you should start collecting information about that you should work on it you should start reading uh, article about that goal you should meet with those people who are connected with that goal so you need to do the practice you need to do imagination also like if you become the person you want to be how it will make you feel and the things about it so second point is to do practices the next one is be persistent i mean maybe you feel negative you don't get response you don't uh, get the kind of target you want to have in your life but still you need to be uh, you need to stay on that point that somewhere or the other you will receive it and the last point we say is like you need to have patience if you don't have patience then maybe you have gone to half of the way or maybe 80% uh, 90% you have achieved your goal but you haven't reached to the final destination you come back because you feel that you did not achieve what you exactly wanted in your life so persistence and patience should be there once you are patient you have patience about the things you want to get in your life you feel that yes i can now wait for that goal and once you wait for it you achieve it and you get it 